And he'll invest 22,000 for six years in a certain scheme with 4% interest per annum, compounded half early. Soon he'll invest in the same scheme for five years, then reinvest the entire amount received at the end of five years for one year at 20% interest. The amounts received by both at the end of six years are same with the initial investment made by Sunil in rupees. Is nice question. So 22,000 into 1.02 to the power 12. Six years compounded half early, 12 compoundings, 4% per annum, so 2%. If Sunil has invested rupees X, 1.02 into power 10. Same scheme for 10 years, so 5 years, so 10 compoundings at 2% and then takes the amount and gets 10% extra into 1.1. These two are equal. 1.02 per 10, 1.02 per 12, we'll have a 1.02 square remaining here. So 1.1 there, but at 22,000 here, lovely. So it should be 20,000. into 1.02 square. I know 1.02 square, which is 1.0404 into 20k. It should be 20,808. 20, he should have put in 20,808 to get the same amount as Anil would have got at the end of the six year period. Hush.